not very sure how I did this, but I got 600k from an easy clue. I guessed uh, this iron plate body G is worth a lot. No idea how, but I, you know, I'll take it. That's that's super interesting. I was doing easy clues just because, like, you need what is it called, like those trousers and certain things for masters. But oh my gosh! Clue casket from Abyssal Demons, and I finished up that task. And let's see what we got. Fingers crossed. Probably gonna be junk. Well, actually, that's like not that bad. I got an ancient page. This is 233k clue. Not bad at all. I actually don't even know if I even have any ancient pages. So let's check that out because the ancient book, if you fill it up, it's plus 10 magic. So let me see if I have that page or not. And if not, then that's going to be some good money to drop over for a bond if I already have it. So let's check it out. Boom, boom, boom. Oh gosh, I have a... Let's see. Oh, nice. So let's see how many I have. I have the first two pages and I need the second and third. Very nice. Halfway complete. Just got an elite casket. I actually had to grind out this bob shirt with easy clues. Um, it wasn't too bad. Basically, I, I think I did like 15 or so when I got the bob shirt, so I'll put that in the crate in a second, but let's open this um, elite casket. Oh my, 425k, we've got a briefcase, palm tree, some oak planks, onyx bolt tips, that's a pretty darn good um, clue. The briefcase alone was 230k. So I did not really expect the first half of my clue, our progress video would be all uh, clue scrolls, but I got a Zamorak coif, which is really nice. I'm not actually sure if I already have one or not, but let me go check. I'm needing more uh, Zamrak items. I think I only had a Ceridomen one, so I'm adding to the collection. I decided to really start doing Clue Scrolls because I, I just have waited so long and I'm already such a higher level Iron Man. It was time to get into it, so let me check my bank. Uh, but yeah, the only Zamorak item I had was the Van Braces and now I officially have all of the Coifs. So Oh, actually, no, I don't. I was thinking Zamorak, Guth, and Ceridoma, but I'm actually missing Bandos and Armadillo, and also probably the Ancient one, too. But, uh, yeah, that's going along pretty well. Um, I did not get to catch it on video, but I got, um, 93 Defense, and now I'm gonna go on to 93 Attack. Sometimes I think I'm recording and then I'm not recording, so I think that's how that happened. But yeah, I, uh, I'm going to go for 93 attack and just slowly get all my combat stats to 99 through Slayer, hopefully. And uh, right now I got that Fossil Wyvern, uh, Fossil Island Wyvern task. <laughs> that was a mouthful, but it's going pretty well. I, I do these because you never know when you'll get lucky with that Wyvern Visage. So, um, But I'm looking forward to my next task. I had a spiritual creature task, and I don't know what's going on, but I got more Guthix chaps and stuff, so I, I got the spiritual creature task, and I dropped a hard clue, and I just keep getting stuff. It's pretty good. Um, I don't think I have any Guthix chaps. I think I only have the Guthix um, helm or coif. But um, what I think I'm going to do here is on my spiritual creature task, I'm going to kill those Sarah Doman uh, mages and then get some Sarah kills in. I've never done Sarah, but I mean, I've soloed it on a main account before, so I'll do it on my Iron Man for the first time. But yeah, so second Guthix piece, nice. And then I don't know what I'm going to do with this Ruin T, but probably here it in here. I'm starting to run out of bank space. Hmm. I just got my first kill on Sarah. It wasn't bad at all. In fact, so far, I think Sarah has been the easiest uh, boss to kill, frankly. Um, out of all of the uh, God of Wars dungeon bosses, I would say Armadillo is the hardest. 
Um, this is super easy solo and I'll probably get a good amount of kills in, I think. I'm trying to get my KC to get my kill count back and hey, I got some dragon boots, so that's nice. Guys, I don't know what's going on, but this is literally like the third superior cave horror. I've, I said horror. I'm sorry. Horror. Horror. Oh, God. Anyway, it's like the third one I've gone on this task. I've never had that many superiors in one task before. Sorry, my bird Kiara is making noise in the background. But yeah, I, I just kind of a little shocked here. Okay, I got a Jad task and I'm super excited. Uh, I think I'm like at 10 Jad kills now, maybe 11. We'll see how this goes. I hope I don't mess up, but I love Jad tasks because they give incredible Slayer XP and all that good stuff. So let's get this going. Oh my gosh, I hate Jad. Ugh. Okay. My new personal best was 42 minutes, and that was my 12th Jad kill. <sighs> oh my gosh, I don't know how I'm ever going to do the Inferno if I can't keep calm even for Jad. I think I have two capes in the bank, let me check. Because I, let's see, yeah, I got two capes, so I'll gamble this one. Um, whew, okay, I have a fire cape. Bargain, yes, nope, I thought so, but that's okay. Um, yeah, that's pretty great, I got my new personal bus. I don't think I'll ever pass 40 minutes off, honestly, but um, maybe one day, but 12th kill, felt good, got some good XP out of it, so. All right, guys, I just finished my neck reel task, and on top of that, we got some amazing limp roots, some alks, which knowing me, most of those alks won't be alk, they'll just be stacked in my bank like the ruined full helms. And I got a hard clue, which I'm gonna do, and a ton of seeds, and all this good stuff. Most of it was already banked because I made multiple inventory runs, but let's see how many look, we got. <clears throat> Almost 200 limp roots, 170-ish, which is great. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and do those, do this hard clue, and see how this goes and then go to the gym. It got a hard clue casket from that neck reel task and oh a holy blessing that's actually super great because Sarah Doman I can use that in my uh, in a slot so that's good and some alcohols. I'm pleased. All right so I got a diagonal task and that means time to do to finish the Fremenic diary because I gotta get 82 rune crafting. I need to go kill Armadillo, finish that elite diary, and then do some Dagonoth Kings. I don't know how long this is gonna take. Killing Armadillo will be pretty quick. 100k left on that 82 rune crafting. I just don't feel like boosting, and plus I'm like, uh, 3, 6, 9, 12, like, four hours from 82 rune crafting? It's not that bad, so. I'm totally down for that Dag task, and hopefully we'll do a guide on Dagonauts eventually. Like, Dagonauts Kings aren't too hard. The problem is, is before you make a guide on something like this, you want to be good at it. So, I just need some practice. Um, pretty straightforward, though. I've done them before. Um, so, hopefully that will be coming soon. Uh, Alright, so I got me a Berserker Ring. I was like, I'm going to solo these DK. <laughs> These DKs, that was so unexpected, yo. I'll take it though. Sorry, my phone was like, I'm still kind of like in shock. What the heck? It's crazy. But anyway, I'll take it. I'll take that three point something mil. I came here to do Dagonoth Kings for like pretty much the diary because I had to kill all three. And I've done all three before, I think. But what happened is I did another diary in between or like I killed two and not Rex or I don't know what I did but that's completed I didn't expect you to stay this long soloing uh Dagnoth uh King's pretty chill uh the only ring I need left is really the Sears ring 
So I'll be doing that eventually, but I will definitely be making a guide for everybody to follow because this stuff's pretty good, and we'll just go with that. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to go finish this Elite Diary, though, because look at all these bones on the ground I'm wasting. Ridiculous. I just, in the groove, you know, I don't want to leave because I'm here. That is honestly a problem because I've got no inventory and I had a hard clue just drop on the ground and I seriously need to get this diary done. What am I doing? Oi, too many bones on the ground to be wasting. The truth is I could not sit there and waste all those bones on the ground and I have 137 left, left on my task. Uh, it was a good thing to test out though because it allowed me to realize that Dagonoth Kings aren't too bad, so um, I could have stayed longer, I just didn't. So, anyway, we're gonna do some stuff like this hard clue and get it going. Okay, so, for the Fremnic Diary, I pretty much have to kill what is it called? Um, like all the God Wars dungeon bosses, which I've done. The problem is, is that every time I've killed them, I've done like another diary in between. So it cancels out the consecutive order of killing all of them, I guess. So basically, I'm going to go do that and I'll do Zami first and then go back and do the other uh, bosses. So I'll, get, I'll try to get a snippet of each kill there. So first of all, I just want to say that I messed up and I brought an abyssal tentacle. You need to bring an arc light. I'm wasting my charges. I messed up. And also, you should probably be on a normal spell book unless you're using blood bras. But you know what? We all mess up in this day. It's okay. Let's do this. God, I forgot anti poison. Come on, Kelsey. We're just gonna get this kill and tell it out because it's ridiculous. Oh my god, please don't die today. Don't die today, honey. I cannot believe I forgot anti poison. I'm so used to bandos. Get off of me. Ah! Thank you. Sheesh. Who forgets you, Criara? Mmm. Six feathers? Six feathers off that ginormous bird. You would think I'd get a little bit something more than that, but... Alright. I got, oh, I have included, okay, apparently I completed the elite task, that was, I didn't even need to go kill Zami. Okay, hold up. I don't even know how to spell consecutive. Yeah, okay, so you can do different diaries in between the God Wars dungeon bosses. I didn't know that, so I don't even know why I went to Zami because... I didn't need to, but that's cool. So that's done. Back to rune crafting. This is a requirement for the elite diary. What? I did it. Why does it say I did create a dragon? Oh, amulet. I made a necklace. That's okay. I got a little bit confused here. Hold up. Hold the phone. What do we need here? We need that <clears throat> wrong thing. This is why reading directions is so important. But yeah, like basically I'm done. The only, shoot. Oh, I think it's just the amulet. Yeah, the only thing I have left is to get that 82 rune crafting and to basically knock that. I mean, I'm 41K away, guys. And I got the front elite done, you know what I'm saying? So... I'm going to go ahead and end this progress video because I'm pretty sure it's getting a little bit long. And uh, I'll catch y'all in the next one. I'm pretty sure the next progress video is going to have a lot of Dagonauts in it because i got to complete that task. Excuse me. And there will be noted bones, so that's dope. And what else? I think that's it that uh, I can think of. The next video is also going to have me finish the Frame Elite and do some other things and just progress with my account. Thank you so much for watching, guys. And if you like this, uh, my progress video or if you like my this, this video, give a thumbs up. And feel welcome to subscribe to my channel to see more uh, future videos. Thanks, guys. Peace out.